I'm Joelle and I am here with pet photographer Janet Zapp. She is fostering a six month old abused pit bull puppy that is up for adoption. Janet, tell us a little bit about Aaron and his story. Uh, Oren was found in Jamaica, Queens uh, by a volunteer of the uh, shelter in Brooklyn and he was taken in, given IV fluids, him and his sister, who was in uh, actually worse shape than him. The thing is with uh, with a lot of these dogs is that because there's a high uh, population of pit bulls in shelters, especially ones that are not healthy, there's a good chance that he could have been euthanized if he wasn't put into foster. So uh, I saw him in a, uh, a blast email and I decided that it was time for me to foster again. And um, you know, he came back from his vet's appointment today. He's doing good. The vet said he basically only has ringworm, which I need to keep him quarantined for a couple of weeks. Uh, and then he'll be put up for adoption. We have to test him to see if he's good with cats and dogs. Um, at this point, we don't know. Um, but he's very friendly and... Uh, very good with people. Very good with people, yes. He loves to kiss. Now, a lot of people watching might say, oh, this is an adorable dog, but if I rescue him, he's still a pit bull. What would you say to people who are a little weary of adopting pit bulls? Uh, if you've never had a pit bull, you have no idea how they are the sweetest, most attentive, intelligent, and loving family pets. I mean, Petey from The Little Rascals was a pit bull. Mm -hmm. Helen Keller had a pit bull. I mean, they are very loving dogs, and they were bred, sure, to, to breed, and some of them do have a little bit more aggression in them, but it's more the owner, the guardian, and not the dog itself. It's just like having a, a German Shepherd. You know, if, if you train it to attack, it's going to attack. Whereas a lot of these dogs are trained to, uh, to fight, and uh, they will, but a lot of the, the VIX uh, pit bulls got rehabilitated to the point where they could be adopted. So it, there's a, they're really wonderful dogs. I, I just learned about pit bulls in the past maybe five years. Um, I, was, I believe the, the misconceptions until I actually met one. And I fostered one earlier this year, and I fell in love with him, but unfortunately he didn't get along with my other dog. Nothing to do with him being a pit bull, just because my other dog has behavioral issues. <laughs> um, but the, uh, you know, and I have also um, become friends with the group, so like um, pinups for pit bulls and a few other pit bull rescues. And I, I just realized what a, an un, you know, they, they think it's such a bad reputation, and they're such a sweet dog. We know that it's common that people will abuse a dog, um, burn them, pour acid on them. Right, you know, hit them with the things. He seems a little more fearful around men than women, so I um, mean, that could also just be because he's not used to being around men, or a man had, had abused him. But either way, he's safe now. He'll never be abused again. He'll be taken good care of. You know, if not here, if somewhere, this is his home. And it's important that people just see up close and personal what is actually happening to dogs on the street and know that they could do something to help them. I just want to say that this is a pit bull eating food and letting me pet him. I know most other breeds that won't even let you go by them when they have food in their mouth.